No guy wants to hike. If your man comes to you one day and goes, hey, let's go hiking, he is planning on killing you on that trail. <laughs> Just be careful. He's gonna come back three days later. Yeah, I went to the bathroom. She must have had her in a rock. I don't know what <laughs> Tell all your friends before you leave on a hiking trip. I don't go back, it's him. Leave notes. <laughs> yeah. Now, I met this girl I kind of like, right? We hung out a few times and then then I find out she's got to bring a service dog on a plane to fly. I'm like, all right, I'm out, you know. <laughs> yeah. I asked her why. She's like, well, you know, I'm afraid the plane's going to crash. That's why I bring my dog. Well, that's pretty selfish if you think about it. <laughs> like, why don't you leave that dog at home with your sister on that little trip? That's a murder-suicide is what that is. It's a piece of shit. <laughs> Like, I gotta fly out on Tuesday. If I have a premonition Monday night, my plane's gonna go down. I'm not gonna yank my kid out of school. Come on, you gotta go to the plane with me. <laughs> He's got his whole life ahead of him. Imagine if I did that, he'd be like, Dad, why am I flying with you? I said, listen, I had a dream last night. My plane's gonna crash. He's like, I'm not gonna fuck you. <laughs> go die alone. I'm going to play with my friends. <laughs> and I looked that up. Like, it's free to bring a service dog on a plane. Like, I, I used to have a dog, right? It cost me 100 bucks each way, 200 round trip. I took my kid to California last month, 600 round trip. Next time I go to the airport with my kid, I'm gonna put a leash around his neck. <laughs> I'm gonna tell him, I go, listen, if anyone from the airline says anything, just bark at him the whole time. <laughs> and if anyone gives me shit with the airline, I go, he identifies as a dog today. You gotta bother. <laughs> you guys have a nice crowd, thanks.